So this came out of nowhere for me. Um, just like my Sonic Frontiers overview trailer has been released. And I know people don't re really react to overview trailers, but I'm the kind of person that might react to things people don't want to react. <laughs> but like, we have barely seen a lick of Sonic Frontiers. Like, like we went through like a long time without seeing anything. And then boom, a story trailer, which showed us like the release date and the price and everything. Like we got everything. And now we're hopefully gonna get a bit more with this overview trailer. I've not seen this yet. So without further ado, Let's get straight into this. In Sonic's newest adventure, he's headed to the Starfall Islands in search of Chaos Emeralds with his friend. Oh, so the Chaos Emeralds do play a big part of the story again. Suddenly okay. Suddenly their plane into a dimensional portal. Our bristly hero awakens a strange digital world called cyberspace. Despite being separated from his friends, Sonic miraculously escapes from this alternate dimension and arrives on Kronos, one of the beautiful Starfall Islands. A curious wilderness full of ancient ruins, strange inhabitants, and sinister huh. enemies. Our loyal blue hedgehog yeah, must now find his already. lost friends, explore this exotic world, and solve the mystery of the Starfall Islands. Sonic Frontiers expands on what fans know and love about traditional Sonic games. Let's hope for that. linear level gameplay and open zone platforming into a new, action-filled Sonic experience. The world map is bigger than ever, giving Sonic more room to run and explore his surroundings. Sonic Frontiers offers high-speed, open-zone gameplay that gives you the freedom to play the game in the order that best matches your playstyle. I mean, engage in exhilarating gotta be a, combat uh, with exciting like new enemies. Games. Solve intriguing Yeah, I, I think the new combos are really good, and the puzzles help it look Sonic's okay. Friends. So. Solving puzzles will reward the player with items that can increase Sonic's power and defense. Rebe I mean, with the gameplay that we saw like a few months ago, and like, the, and we still see like the gameplay now, I truly hope there's like an interface in the in the top part of the screen that shows like what those items do and how many of those you have. Because like, if they're trying to reduce clutter, sure, fine. I can, I can see why there's nothing on there, but like, of course, you gotta have like the life count, or if there is a life count in this game, or like the ring count, or like the amount of thing, the amount of uh, amount of those things you have. So maybe they just cut this. Maybe they just remove that just for this gameplay. Maybe in the final release they'll have it. Hidden parts of the map, and unlock new ways to navigate the island at fast speeds. Scattered around the Starfall Islands are cyberspace portals. Yeah. Defeat bosses throughout the island to earn portal gears that unlock these stages. You'll need to complete oh, so those gears unlock the stages. Okay. Each cyberspace stage to earn vault keys that can be used to unlock Chaos Emerald vaults and allow you to progress further in the game. In Sonic Frontiers, okay. it's a big. It's I like this. It's it's complicated but easy at the same time. Sonic's combat gets an upgrade making battling enemies more exciting and fluid than ever before. With an all-new skill tree system featuring a host of new abilities... So there is a skill tree, up, okay. You'll have plenty of options to fight strategically, combine dodges, parries, counters, and more. Yeah, we've seen most if of this already. If you more straightforward gameplay, check out Auto Combos, where various attack combos can be executed with a single button. These modes make it possible for all Sonic fans to easily enjoy the fast and flexible new combat system. Sonic's enhancements don't stop there. He's learned a new ability called Silute, a band of light that mirrors Sonic's tracks. Surround enemies, items, and areas to uncover different effects and unlock all the secrets of the Starfall Islands. Get ready to blaze your own trail and forge a new frontier in Sonic Frontiers. <laughs> Available November 8th. Stay tuned yeah. for more details. So, yeah, I'm surprised they're doing, like, on the Switch, too. Because I'm not going to lie, like... Switch version going to be, like, a crisp 480p at this point. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, uh, that, that was okay. That was an okay trailer. Yeah, I think it could have been uh, a little bit, like, better structured, but... Overall, like, it's an overview trailer. It gives you an overview of Sonic Frontiers. But I feel like the guy was talking a little bit too much for my liking, but... Hey. I... I am excited for Sonic Frontiers, and... 
judging from judging from what we saw, I'm probably gonna say like this game. This game might be like a seven out of ten game for me. Like Sonic Forces was like a four or five out of ten. This game might be like a seven or maybe even like a seven point five or an eight. So we don't know. We'll just have to see.